Corner. My name is Angelica and in today's video I'm going to be sharing my new savings challenge which is my monthly savings challenge so let's go ahead and get started with the video. If you're new to my channel welcome to this awesome space so happy to have you guys all here today. Today I'm going to be doing my monthly savings challenge and I decided to go with the Harry Potter theme in case you're wondering what is she talking about. So I've created four themes for um, my 12 month savings challenge. They're available in my Etsy shop, the Tracker's Corner. I will leave the link down below so you go ahead and see um, the different options of this monthly savings challenge. Even though January we're midway, you can still get it, you can get ahead of it. I created four themes as well as four different savings challenge. I'm going to be doing the $600 for the year because I'm going to be doing multiple savings challenges um, right now this I'm doing the Harry Potter theme sorry these are backwards because I was um, showing them but this is December November October um, September then we have August July June May April April March February and then I have January and these have 10 circles um 10 scratch offs to do um since this is a 600 obviously you probably be like well you know what you what you have under yes because I've made these but they have low amounts which I'm happy with that and in the description of the listing I explain all of that to you guys just so you know this is an a5 savings challenge I'm sorry a5 envelope and this does fit in a5 so look at the size and when I go ahead and I put this in here Someone have asked me, does this fit the A5? Yes, it does. Guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so every time I post a video, you will get notified. But let's get right to the scratching. Okay, so I made this envelope because I wanted to, to use to put my money in. Now, I do have a sinking fund that I created last year. There was a challenge sinking fund. I'll put my money, every time I get paid, I'll put money towards this um, envelope. And then from here, I'll use it for all my savings challenges. So since it's 10 and we're halfway, I'm going to try to do uh, five of them. Might as well. So let's start with the first one. These are four by six. I'm probably saying this wrong. I can't think of the right size somehow I forgot already. But I'll leave it up here if I remember while I'm doing this video. So we have three. Yay. Three dollars. So I'm just going to keep scratching until I get all five. So the cool thing is that when you start scratching, right, um, you will be able to see the image will reveal on the bottom. I did a Harry Potter chic flower and a note theme. So I really like Harry Potter and I know many people will appreciate or will enjoy the Harry Potter theme. And the other things are so cute. I'll leave the video up here so you can see. So we have an, a five. I'll leave a video up here so you guys can see um, the other challenges that I have and then we have a five a four so I decided to do not only like four circles but I did eight um ten because when the bigger amounts come up um I want it to be not like crazy numbers under here to reveal you know so that's another thing so we are at six and then we can add everything together. And then the last one. We have a seven. So, so cool. You can see that the image starts revealing itself. And let me get my... Let me get my calculator because I don't feel like adding these um, in my head. So we have three, three, oh my gosh, sorry. We got three plus five plus four plus six plus seven. That is $25. So here in this envelope, put this to the side. So right here, my challenge jump, I'm going to get $25 out of here. So I got a 20 one two three four and five you know what I have a five here so I'm gonna use these so I can leave the ones for later 
So 25. And that leaves me with 20, 40, 50, 60, and 70, and 75. See, my counting bad. 20, 40, 50, 60, and 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82. So it leaves 82 dollars left in the challenge envelope. And then put this to the side. And then I love anything holographic in case you haven't noticed. I have a holographic envelope. I'm going to be getting myself an A5 envelope, but I'm going to go ahead and put monthly my savings challenge here. So I'll be putting 25. And like I'm saying, this fits in here. So I put this for the month. And then what I'm going to do is they all fit in there, but I'm just going to be alternating um, for every month. Since this is January, I just put the January one in here. And boom, there you go. That is my first savings challenge of the month, of the year too. So I'm super excited. I hope that everyone who has purchased um, these savings challenges from me, thank you so much. I hope that you truly enjoy them. They're going to be fun. I find scratch-offs very satisfying. I don't know why, but I think it's very fun to do. So thank you so much. I will see you all in my next video. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so every time I post a video, you will get notified. I'll see you in my next video.